Hello everyone, I am Dr. Neema, Consultant Physician, Sri Narayani Hospital, Vellu. Today, I will be talking about thyroid diseases. So, what is a thyroid gland? Okay, thyroid gland is a structure which is present in front of your neck, which is normally present. So, if this structure or the gland is functioning more, it is called hyperthyroidism and if it is functioning less, it will be called hypothyroidism. So, what causes this problem? So, one cause which was previously present was because of iodine deficiency, which currently we do not see because most of us use iodized salt. Another most common cause which we see now is autoimmune. What is autoimmune? Autoimmune is your immunity is against the thyroid gland. Your body itself is producing uh, some immunity against the thyroid gland that causes uh, thyroid diseases which can have both hyper and hypothyroidism. Other causes could be because of viral infection. Few of the viruses can affect the thyroid gland and infect them. Then few causes like a nodule in a thyroid gland can cause hypersecretion of these uh, hormones and can cause increase in the thyroid uh, problems. So what, uh, let's talk about what are the symptoms in hypo and hyperthyroidism. Okay, so who should get this thyroid uh, function test done? Okay, so you can get the thyroid function test in your blood. Who have symptoms in hypothyroidism, they will have symptoms of hair loss, weight gain, and they will uh, have dry skin, irregular menstrual cycles. They can have uh, constipation, or sometimes even neurological symptoms like they can have any uh, pins and needle sensation in their hands and feet or they can have low mood, depression, etc. Whereas people with hyperthyroidism usually will have weight loss. They will feel very hungry, they want to eat more but they'll be losing a lot of weight and they can have their own heart rate, uh, they can feel their own heart rate, heartbeat. So they can have increased heart rate and they can have heat intolerance that is they feel hot very fast even in a normal temperature they feel warm and sweaty and uh, so who else has to get this tested so people who have high cholesterol levels also it's ideal to get a thyroid level done because hypothyroidism is linked to hypercholesterolemia as well and people who have diabetes also, we prefer them to get their thyroid function tests at least once a year. So if you have these symptoms, you can go to your nearby hospital and get the thyroid function test done. Thank you.